boyfriend has never really came out in my videos, so this is like a proper way to introduce him. This is my big head boyfriend. Say your name. Don't be shy. My name's Gabriel. Uh, and he he has my heart, y'all. So y'all cannot hear his line because I would have catch a case. My name, my boyfriend's room is looking really messy right now. Again, I got this one at Walmart too. Live and love to the fullest, and it came with little hearts. That's what I really liked about it. And then we have this picture just of me and my boo. And then we go down here, and then there's another one of me and my boo. And then you're gonna go to the other wall, and then there's another one of me and my man to get to let you guys know a little bit more about us and each other. All the wonderful stuff. Maybe y'all may know him not. My boyfriend, Gabriel. Now, aren't we? I could just never get enough. What is up, you guys? And welcome back to my channel. My channel. Our channel. <laughs> yeah. You guys, so we just got to Disneyland while we're in the parking lot. My family's over there. I have hey, cars. What's up, guys? Like, like, who matches better than us? <laughs> Period. It should be yeah. interesting. This is gonna be real interesting. So, tell them what you did, Gabriel. Out and. I picked the color for him. I'm just afraid to be wearing the waist. Yo, I hope y'all worked up an appetite. I hope you worked up an appetite. Boy, I've been ready. I know I'm hungry. It's 11:30s, and welcome back to my channel. So excited! Are you excited? Yeah, because it was so hard to find a name. A full breed husky. Meet him. Oh, look at him. We're moving. <laughs> We're saying goodbye. It's emotional because this apartment, literally, we, this was our first, our first apartment. apartment. Like, it was so emotional, but literally, guys, let me show you guys. We got most, like, all the living room done, except for, like, there's a lot of stuff in my house. This is what we ended up wearing. I picked out this outfit, and I absolutely love it. So, I am gathered here with my lovely fiance. Just kidding, I wish. I need a ring. Uh, you guys, this is like making my sickness go away. It's like a 50% chance it's not raining outside. Uh, this was because it just irritated me and I'm like, okay, that's what boyfriends are for. If you don't if you don't pop my blackheads, why are you with me? Period. I always make sure you're good. So don't mind my little Rudolph baby right here. <laughs> Guys, you guys obviously read the title for this video, that's why you probably clicked on it, or you just probably clicked on it because you want to see my handsome boyfriend. So it's obviously Valentine's Day, and I told Kate, you know what, babe? We gotta bake. Like, I'm. Um, we gotta bake, period. We're gonna do cute couple clingy things. Good morning! <laughs> okay, close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes. Keep them closed, keep them closed. Okay, wait, just stay right there and then keep them closed, okay? Close. Okay, come. Open up. <laughs> oh, Guys. Bienvenidos otra vez a mi And it's like, you say yes to everything I say. Even though you already do that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, okay, you guys, so we are on our way. I literally changed so fast we ran up there. But this is what me and Gabriel are wearing. Talking and let's play this intro in you want to do the
into this video, as you can see, I'm with the one and only Gabriel, and he is my special guest today. And today, as you can see, we are in the bathtub. A little different environment, something new, Taking something you know. What do you mean? Because we're about to go watch the sunset, so I'm like, sunset vlog. Happy birthday to you. Good morning, happy birthday, Bobby. The big 25. Okay, but it's like down downstairs. Yeah, like down there. Coming through here, hey, surprise, a little something. Thank you, baby. Do anything, cut? You say you didn't cut it, but like there. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get Chris to come. I don't know. No. <laughs> you cute, baby. You like him, baby? It was either Miami, I wanted to go to Tulum, but we didn't get our passports in time. So, <laughs> yeah. We were like, you know what? Miami. So, you guys, this is my second time being out. But here is our Vlogmas 2020 intro. Right now we're doing a little mini road trip. I have my boyfriend with me right now. It's literally at 10 o'clock. Wow. Gabriel's cutting. Wow, wow. You made it You made it or what? <laughs> Look at so without further ado, this is our 2021 Vlogmas intro. I never thought in a million years I would be sitting down making a video like this. I'm still in shock. I'm still in disbelief. 
it's like I'm not. I don't even know how to explain it, you guys. You guys, my my boyfriend of five years caught his wings. It was called home. You see, like little heads. It's my fur babies right here. <laughs> no prince. I miss them too. I'm honestly doing this because this is how I'm coping with it. I've never experienced anything like this, went through something like this. I've done social media for years now. You guys watched me and my boyfriend's relationship from day one. You guys watched us grow and through our ups and our downs. He passed away. 11-9. 2022 a week before my birthday it's been so hard i honestly don't know how i'm like still waking up still getting out of bed still doing it like i barely started eating and drinking water um I would just be straight up with y'all, like, I wanted to die, like, I was trying to starve myself. I was trying, but I just want to be with my man. That's all I know, that's, that's where my heart is, where my soul is. It's still a shocker to me, I'm still in disbelief, I still am coping with it. Like I said, I would have never expected in a million years for something like this to happen. I'm sorry if you can see all that, it's my dog, is there? Every time I cry, they really come from me. <laughs> They're all I have left of you. <laughs> so, I'm making this video not to <laughs> have you guys feel bad. Not for none of that. I This is how I'm dealing with it. I feel good when I film, when I post, when I, you know, that was, if anyone who knew me knew that is what I enjoy doing, that's what brought me happiness, you guys are like my best friends, oh, it just sucks, and it hurts, and when I really sit and think about it, like, I'm here alone, I don't have my soulmate, this is somebody I woke up next to every day for five years, I went to sleep with every day for five years, <laughs> I feel so lost, I feel so empty, I feel helpless, I feel like there's nothing I can do. Everybody who knew my boyfriend knew he was so pure-hearted, knew what kind of person he was. <laughs> so I loved him so much. I don't understand why um, this has to happen to me. <laughs> it's not fair. <laughs> Um, but I wish I was with him. I know it's not my timing, but it's like, <laughs> the only thing that saved my life was a seatbelt. And it's just like, <laughs> I would have <laughs> want to rather go with him. I would have, I know, deep down. <sighs> and that's what. I just want right now, you know, I just want to be with my boyfriend, like, I don't care about nothing else in the world, like, my life changed so much within a day, within a night, within him gone, having to go through something so traumatic and so, like, I don't even know how I'm here still, I'm still pulling through, I feel feel him every day. I know it's him getting me up in the morning. I know it's him giving me the strength to keep going. But it's just really hard because it's not fair. It's not fucking fair. This was somebody I was supposed to get old with, have kids, marriage, and that the last image I know of him is 
me begging and begging God, yelling for him to be okay. We spent our last moments together. Nobody needs an explanation, nobody, you know, none of that, but this is what I do, this is what I enjoy. I know I'm I'm not going to ever heal from this, I'm not going to ever be the same. It's a journey, but maybe, you know, it is going to get better, I don't know, uh, all my emotions are like... I feel numb, I don't feel like, I don't know how to explain it, like I've never lost a boyfriend before, this was somebody that was my first boyfriend ever, I was his first boyfriend, he had just came out the closet, like, all our videos, all everything, we would always talk about how <laughs> we'd have them as memories, and we would show them to our kids one day, and... <laughs> That's why I loved doing YouTube. I was, it's like my personal diary. I don't know why this had to happen to me. I don't like questioning God, but I have to sit there and think why. Like, what did I do to deserve this? Why? It hurts so much. The day he left, I lost a part of myself that I don't think I'll ever get back. He's in heaven right now, living in paradise, my little alien. Just hug your loved ones, take photos, don't take life for granted. I have a long journey ahead of me, and maybe he'll not be next to me physically. But I know he's next to me every step of the way. <sighs> you know, everyone loved my boyfriend. Like, everybody did. Everyone loved him just because he loved me, you know? There was a lot I wanted to say in this video, but now filming, it's like my mind's going blank. I feel him here with me. I feel him patting my back. I'm just so broken without you, babe. <laughs> Why did you have to go? <laughs> Every day is different. Grief is so crazy. I've never experienced grief like this before. But all I can say is I have another guardian angel above watching over me. <laughs> oh. I just wish I could hug him. And I wish I could just hear his voice one more time. I don't think one day I will ever understand why God had to take my husband, the love of my life, my soul made away from me. This is it. This is it. It's a reality that I wish I don't have to live, but... I'll see you guys in another video. I don't know when, but I really just wanted to do this video because it copes, it helps me, it genuinely is helping me, it's, I'm gonna keep my baby's name alive forever, L-L-G-E-R, my little alien, oh my god, that's gonna be all for this video, you guys, I don't know when the next time I'm gonna see you guys, but, so hug your loved ones, kiss them, hug them tight, because you don't ever know when it's going to be the last day on earth. Nobody knows when. Nobody.